subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon, to never miss a video from us. In this video, you'll learn about, some commonly asked questions in AWS Cloud Practitioner Certification Exam. So let's get started. Question 1, which DynamoDB feature, can be used to reduce the latency of requests, to a database from milliseconds to microseconds? 1. Memcached. 2. Multi-AZ. 3. Read Replica. 4. DAX. The correct answer is 4. DAX. Question 2. Which AWS service uses edge locations to cache content? 1. AWS KMS. 2. AWS CloudFront. 3. AWS Inspector. 4. AWS Glacier. The correct answer is 2. AWS CloudFront. Question 3. Which of the given options is a key factor for calculating total cost of ownership for the AWS Cloud? 1. The number of users migrated to AWS. 2. The number of passwords migrated to AWS. 3. The number of servers migrated to AWS. 4. Number of keys migrated to AWS. The correct answer is 3. The number of servers migrated to AWS. Amazon RDS. Question 5. Which of the following AWS offering allows customers to find, buy, and immediately start using software solutions in their AWS environment? 1. AWS SDK. 2. AWS OpsWorks. 3. AWS Config. 4. AWS Marketplace. The correct answer is 4. AWS Marketplace Question 6. Which of the following is the responsibility of AWS according to the shared security model? 1. Performing auditing tasks. 2. Securing access to AWS resources. 3. Monitoring AWS resources usage. 4. Securing regions and edge locations. The correct answer is 4. Securing regions and edge locations. Four, use the right combination of storage classes based on the different use cases. Question eight, which of the following is not an AWS reservation model? One, S3 reserved capacity. Two, Redshift reserved nodes. Three, DynamoDB reserved capacity. Four, ElastiCache reserved nodes. The correct answer is one, S3 reserved capacity. Question 9. Where can you find the information about prohibited actions on AWS infrastructure? 1. AWS Acceptably as Policy. 2. AWS Cloud Compliance. 3. AWS Identity and Access Management. 4. AWS Inspector. The correct answer is 1. AWS Acceptably as Policy. Question 10. Who is responsible for scaling the DynamoDB databases? 1. The development team. 2. AWS. 3. None of these. 4. The DevOps team. The correct answer is 2. AWS. Question 11. 
which statement best describes the operational excellence pillar of the AWS well-architected framework. 1. The ability of a system to recover gracefully from failure. 2. The ability to monitor and improve system processes and procedures. 3. The ability to provision resources on demand. 4. The ability to manage data center operations more efficiently. The correct answer is 2. The ability to monitor and improve system processes and procedures. Question 12. Which of the following services can be used to identify the user that made the API call, when an Amazon Elastic Compute Cloud Amazon EC2, instance is terminated? 1. AWS Cloud Trail 2. Amazon Cloud Watch 3. AWS X-Ray 4. AWS Identity and Access Management The correct answer is 1. AWS Cloud Trail Question 13. Let us suppose Peter is facing problems with the current contact center. Which of the following service provides a cloud-based contact center that can deliver a better service for the customers? 1. None of these. 2. Amazon Work Mail. 3. Amazon Light Sail. 4. Amazon Connect. The correct answer is 4. Amazon Connect. Question 14. Let us suppose a user has an application developed in .NET, such that this application works with the S3 buckets in a particular region. This application is hosted on an EC2 instance. Which of the following should be used to ensure that the EC2 instance has the appropriate access to the S3 buckets? 1. AWS Identity and Access Management Roles 2. AWS Groups 3. AWS Users 4. AWS AWS Identity and Access Management Policies The correct answer is 1. AWS Identity and Access Management Roles Question 15. Where can AWS customers find their historical billing information? 1. AWS DCO 2. Billing and Cost Management Console 3. AWS Simple Monthly Calculator 4. AWS Billing History The correct answer is 2. Billing and Cost Management Console Question 16. How much data can you store in S3? 1. Each account is given 50 GB of storage capacity and no more can be used. 2. You can store up to 1 petabyte of data, then you are required to pay an additional fee. 3. Storage capacity is virtually unlimited. 4. You can store up to 1 petabyte of data. The correct answer is 3. Storage capacity is virtually unlimited. Question 17. Which of the following services allows you to run containerized applications on a cluster of EC2 instances? 1. Amazon Elastic Docker Service 2. Amazon Elastic Compute Service 3. AWS Docker Manager 4. Amazon Elastic Container Service The correct answer is 4. Amazon Elastic Container Service Question 18. Why are serverless architectures more economical than server-based architectures? 1. With serverless architectures, you have the ability to scale automatically as demand changes. 2. With the server-based architectures, servers continue to run all the time. But with the serverless architectures, the code runs only when needed. 3. When you reserve serverless capacity, you will get large discounts compared to server reservation. 4. Serverless architectures use new powerful computing devices. The correct answer is 2. Question 19. Which of the following AWS network features helps to establish a private network connection between AWS and the data center? 1. Amazon CloudFront 2. AWS Route 53 3. AWS Direct Connect 4. AWS Snowball The correct answer is 3. AWS Direct Connect Question 20. AWS provides excellent cloud-based disaster recovery services, utilizing their multiple 1. Edge Locations 2. Support plans. 
3. Regions. 4. Transportation devices. The correct answer is 3. Regions. Question 21, which of the following is a benefit of the loose coupling approach? 1. Allows you to bid on, spare Amazon EC2 computing capacity. 2. The development team can modify the underlying implementation, without affecting other components of the application. 3. Enables users to quickly deploy only the approved IT services they need. 4. Reduces privileged access to your resources. The correct answer is 2. Question 22. Which of the following services helps to analyze EC2 instances against predefined security templates, in order to check for vulnerabilities in our system? 1. AWS Shield. 2. AWS Web Application Firewall. 3. AWS Trusted Advisor. 4. AWS Inspector. The correct answer is 4. AWS Inspector. Question 23, which of the following is the most appropriate means, for developers to store Docker container images in the AWS cloud? 1. Elastic Container Service. 2. Elastic Beanstalk. 3. Elastic Container Registry. 4. Elastic Map Reduce. The correct answer is 3. Elastic Container Registry. Question 24. Which of the following is not a characteristic of Amazon Elastic Compute Cloud? 1. It offers scalable computing capacity in the AWS Cloud. 2. It is considered a serverless web service. 3. It eliminates the need to invest in hardware upfront, so you can develop and deploy applications faster. 4. It can be used to launch as many or as few virtual servers as needed. The correct answer is 2. It is considered a serverless web service. Question 25, you want to transfer 200 terabytes of data from on-premises locations to the AWS cloud, which of the following can do the job in a cost-effective way? 1. AWS Snowmobile 2. AWS Snowball 3. AWS DMS 4. AWS Import slash Export The correct answer is 2. AWS Snowball Question 26. What does Amazon ElastiCache provide? 1. An Amazon EC2 instance, with Memcached software already pre-installed. 2. A service with this name doesn't exist. 3. A virtual server with huge amount of memory. 4. A managed in-memory cache service. The correct answer is 4. A managed in-memory cache service. Question 27. Which of the following AWS service can be used as a global content delivery network service? 1. Amazon Cloud Trail. 2. Amazon CloudFront. 3. Amazon SES. 4. Amazon S3. The correct answer is 2. Amazon CloudFront. Question 28. In order to store a large number of archive documents, a user requires a storage solution. Which of the following is the best suited storage solutions in AWS in this case? 1. Amazon EBS Volumes 2. Amazon Glacier 3. Amazon S3 4. Amazon EBS Snapshots The correct answer is 2. Amazon Glacier Question 29 what is the easiest way to launch and manage a virtual private server in AWS? 1. Using Amazon Route 53. 2. Using Amazon LightSail. 3. Using AWS Virtual Private Network. 4. Using Amazon Virtual Private Cloud. The correct answer is 2. Using Amazon LightSail. Question 30. Which Amazon EC2 reserved instance type is ideal for an application that runs 3 hours a day, 5 days a week? 1. Mixed RIs. 2. Convertible RIs. 3. Scheduled RIs. 4. Standard RIs. The correct answer is 3. Scheduled RIs. 
Question 31. What does Amazon Elastic Beanstalk provide? 1. A scalable cluster of EC2 instances. 2. A service by this name doesn't exist. 3. An application container on top of Amazon Web Services. 4. A scalable storage appliance, on top of Amazon Web Services. The correct answer is 3. An application container on top of Amazon Web Services. For more such videos, subscribe to our channel.